Okay, so today we're going to be looking at capitalization. Um, so imagine we've got this uh, string, hello my name is Flojo, and it's all in capitals. How do we actually get that to lowercase? Well, imagine we have a variable of chat, which has hello my name is Flojo in capitals assigned to it. You just use a function called to lower. You pass in the string, the variable in this instance of chat, and it will return hello my name is Flojo in lowercase. Right, so what if we want to change lowercase to uppercase? Well, say we've got the same variable, but this time, hello, my name is Flojo is in lowercase. We use a function called to upper. We pass the string in, or in our case, the variable of chat to to upper. And then what actually happens is we get a return of hello, my name is Flojo in capitalizations. So let's actually take a look at this in Power Automate. So we've got an example variable here. Um, we have an example string of hello my name is flojo in capitals. So what we're firstly going to do is change this to a lowercase using to lower. So as previously shown, you use to lower and you actually pass in the variable or the string. Uh, so we're using the example string of hello my name is flojo in capitals, we're passing in. And then if we use to upper, we're going to change what we get back from our to lower, which will be the lowercase, and then change it back into uppercase. So let's actually take a look at this in action. So I'm just going to kick off the flow and let's take a look at what we get back. Okay, so um, we've got our example variable which uh, started as hello my name is Flojo in capitals. We then converted it to a lowercase which is hello my name is Flojo in lowercase. And then we've converted our lowercase to an uppercase by using hello my name is Flojo in upper. So that is how you use both upper and lower cases um, in Power Automate. That's it from me, Flojo. Check out my blog at flojo.io for more guides on the Power Platform. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.